Welcome back to the Two Minute Updates from the Bob Davis Podcasts. Uh, Tom Emmer's here, but I got a little bit of a sunburn this weekend. <laughs> so, <laughs> look at this. My neck is white and my chest is red. So I got a little bit of a sunburn. So quite honestly, I, uh, I can't even get up and walk over to Tom. So Tom is here. He's sitting over in the corner. I'm just hanging out. What are we going to talk about today? Uh, Mitt Romney is an idiot. Uh, Mitt Romney said over the weekend that he believes in global warming and the human, humans cause global warming. And this is after the Tea Party said, uh, the Tea Party Express uh, chairwoman said that uh, she was down with supporting any Republican candidate, including um, Mitt Romney. So now, once again, the question's going to be, are you going to support Rim not Mitt Romney, Min Romney, knowing that he is a, a believer in global warming? <laughs> what an idiot. Um, what else is going on? We have 3,000 jail cells in the state of Minnesota open in various counties, and we're getting people shot on the street. So we're going to talk. Tom has a completely different take on the story than I do. His question is, how are the jails run and what are they costing these counties? My take is, we got 3,000 cells. We can put 6,000 gang members in jail uh, and get them off the street. Let's do it. What else? Um, do you think it's okay for teachers and administrators in schools to retire, collect a pension, and collect a salary, in some cases six figures, like more than the governor makes? Is that okay with you? We're going to talk about that. Uh, Phil Crinky joins us at uh, 7.36 this morning from the Taxpayers League to talk about the budget deal and some other things going on. They're spending a uh, million dollars at least to uh, bang down Republicans for uh, this budget deal. And of course, the government shutdown is coming and everyone is afraid for their lives because of the government shutdown. <gasps> what are we going to do? The government's going to shut down. What else, Tom? Sue Jeffers is coming in at 806. We're going to talk about karma. The city of Minneapolis wants to close Karma in downtown because it's a public nuisance. Something like 450 calls there for the police in the last couple of years. 165 this year so far. We'll talk about that. Um, actually, Sue has a completely different take than I do. I said close it. She says that they're just really coming down on these businesses, whether it's the new ordinances in Uptown about the outdoor cafes or closing Karma, and she does not believe it should be uh, closed. And... Uh, I'm also just incensed that the president insists on saying they saved GM and Chrysler. Nothing could be further from the truth. You're at least $14 billion in the hole on this as a taxpayer, and it may even be more than that. We'll talk about it coming up at 6 a.m. this morning at Newstock 100.3 FM. I'm sorry for the boring nature of my report this morning, but Tom just can't get up either. Apparently, apparently he hey. is. Apparently, he's also sunburned. So. This is the first day. Of the new show. This is the first day of the rest of your life. Yes, it's official. It's D-Day and it's official. So we have an auspicious date to begin the show officially here at News Talk 100.3. Join us, won't you?